This is Christian Svarvar here again, and I'd like to welcome you to today's tutorial about arpeggiated ricochet, also called saltando. Arpeggiated ricochet is almost like a dance of the bow, where it sort of bounces off the string and weaving intricate arpeggios. It might seem a little bit tricky at first, but the rewards of mastering these techniques are quite enjoyable, so I promise you it's worth it. I may have to practice a little bit more on the Paganini part, but I think you'll get the idea. Previous discussions, we talked about the thumb and its placement, and once again, this fundamental aspect plays a pivotal role. Ensure your thumb maintains bent, giving your other fingers the freedom to embrace a state of relaxation. And much like the finesse required for spiccato, the arpeggiated ricochet thrives in the balance between engagement and relaxation. This balance is best achieved when your right arm maintains a relatively stable position, only doing the necessary motions from the G-string to the E-string. Begin by playing a legato arpeggio, coursing from the G-string to the E-string and back. Then increase the speed and make a gap, in other words, lift the bow after each stroke. Continue while making the gap smaller and smaller. Now try to do the exact same thing, but while bouncing gently on each string. And when you have established an even pace, try to give a gentle kick on the G string, maybe also a little impulse on the E string going back. And the motion is actually very similar to bouncing a ball on the floor. Try that and good luck.